All right. All right, today, real quick, I'm gonna show you guys how to get, oh, well, let me get over here. Today, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get the Knight's Calvary set. Uh, first thing you wanna do is hoist your secret medallion, if you have it. Uh, pretty much how you get it is just beating Commander Neil, and he'll pretty much give it to you. The other piece is somewhere else. <laughs> in a swamp somewhere kind of hard to explain i won't be showing it today anyways you always just seek it at uh medallion to get up uh but anyways i'm gonna show you guys a quick and easy way to get the knight's calvary set i've already shown the black raptor so now it's time for the knight's calvary set all right well, let's just get straight into it real quick. I'm going to show you guys how to get from it from here because it is a little difficult to get. Especially if you don't know the way. So, pretty much once you done hoist it yourself all the way up here, you get this nice little sexy transition. Um, to the top. Once you made it all the way up here, you might want to get a weapon where you can do a little bit of dodging because we're going to be doing a little bit of running. Right? So pretty much you're going to want to go ahead and, and equip your lantern because obviously you're going to need to see. And this place is pretty damn dark. Alright, so you're going to want to head out these double doors right here. And make a left right here go up the stairs. Like I said, you might want to dodge your weapon because these kids can literally one shot you if you're not careful. Something's going to drop from the roof. So watch out for that. And like I said, watch out for all these little guys. They do plenty of damage. And once you get up here, you're going to want to rest at this grease. Or click it if you haven't already. But you're definitely going to want to rest at it either way. Alright, making your way up to the top of these stairs. This is where it gets tricky because you cannot see anything. But you'll be inside the consecrated snow fields. Now, where we're headed is to this great straight, this gray site straight in front of us. So, I would um, say put some lights just like that. And we're just going to head straight across. And like I said, you want to just put some lights because it is pretty foggy snowy you also want to watch your step all right oh there's actually a grace right here this is a grace i was looking for in the beginning oh yeah touch that so there's actually a third grace right here in the middle all right so you want to keep following your little arrows you marked right We're going to come down this path over here. Like I said, make sure you watch your step. You might need to go around at times. You definitely don't want to fall from any far drops. That would suck. Anyways, you're going to want to speed through here because you can see this stuff spawning all around as you can see. Speed over here. And make sure you got these nice little lights. They do come in handy. All right. And let's see. Like I said, another cliff. You really want to watch where you're going. The grease is literally right in front of us. Um, so we're just gonna look for a way down without falling, of course. So I'm guessing we got to go a little down to our left hand side. Yep. And then here's the convoy that we are going to be attacking. It's gonna have two black knight cavalry, so you're gonna want to watch out for that. But I do have a way. Who defeat them? Anyways, the grease is right over here to your right, and you're also gonna be able to start seeing things, so that's gonna be good. Um, and then you wanna just rest at this grace right here. All right, now here comes the tricky part. Like I said, there's two night cavalry, so this is gonna be a little intense. Here's the grace site once again, so we pretty much came from all the way over here, hidden path to this grace right here, consecrated snow fields to the inner constant created snow field basically right here so this is the grace you're going to want to be at and you're going to whip out your there was a blood or whatever weapon of your choice to go ahead and take out these guys matter of fact i might use a little bit of magic so here's the convoy and i learned a little trick watching a couple youtube videos see these guys you're going to want to get their attention get their attention just like so 
Oh, snap. All right. And pretty much you're going to want to run over to this ledge over here. Trust me, they will follow, maybe. Okay. And pretty much, I'm pretty sure it's this ledge right here. Nope. Oh, God. Uh, it was one of these ledges. <laughs> I thought it was this ledge, but I might be wrong. Maybe it's this ledge right here. Right? And pretty much you want to just separate them so you can take out one at a time. That's the objective of really cool. Alright, so I'm going to just go ahead and... Oh, that's right. That's right. Oh, and watch out for big monsters, you know? Who might want to kill you. That'd be good. Where did he come from? He was just pissed for no reason. Like, Brody, relax, bro. It's not even your fight. Okay, this is not going how I planned it. But anyways, we separated one, and Brody, big guy, is gone. So that's good. We try and take out this guy in river or something like. Oh, we're just gonna absolutely clap us. Yikes, bro. I can you just relax. He's gonna try and curve stomp me. He's trying to juke me. I won't fall for it. All right, so we gotta take advantage of these Susie strikes. Oh, that was kind of early. I am not very good at this, as you guys can see. We're gonna get this. We're gonna get this done. I promise. He's gonna hit me. Oh, lucky. These guys should be pretty easy, but I'm just pretty damn bad. I'm not gonna cap. <laughs> and he's moving around a lot, so it's making it very hard to hit this guy. Oh my god, can I just like land one hit and I'll be satisfied? Why am I dodging to Oh my god, this man's scaring me. Oh, this. Can you just stop moving around? And he's one shot him. <laughs> no, please. Okay, um, like I said, this is what kind of makes it hard. He's just moving around. He's the most I've seen this guy move around and he's just blasting. I can't even dodge. Alright, time to pull up this jump. And I'm still taking damage. Alright, so the best action, course of action, is to just run at this point. Just run back to the grease where you can be out of harm's way. And we're just gonna give this another try. See, where's your grace? Grace, come to me. That was kind of a botched plan. This was supposed to be a foolproof plan. This was supposed to be no fails, no no holes, no patches, alright? So anyways, now we're going to try and do it this way. We're going to try and knock Buddy Boy. Excuse me, guys. Sorry, it's up. We're going to try and knock Buddy Boy. Oh my god, why does he do so much? What the freak is that? Okay, buddy. Okay. Um, watch out for the blue lightning disco balls. You know. Oh, also, guys, I I forgot to mention since I already had it set to night. You're gonna want to set it to nightfall, and that's the only way they're gonna spawn. All right. Now, I got a little trick up my sleeve, and by trick, I mean spamming. So you're gonna absolutely wanna avoid those blue lightning things, cause they can absolutely just doo-doo and just ruin your whole day. All right. And what you're gonna wanna do is take your Kamehameha and just absolutely blast Oh, come on. Look at that. He's gonna get pissed. He's gonna get very, very pissed. Oh my god, that was almost the only swing I've ever seen.
right? You're gonna wanna try and take him out one by one. Okay, they have stopped moving around so much. Alright, you're gonna try and take as less hits as you can, if possible. Why are they moving around so much? Oh, no, no. Brody's really trying not to die. Alright. Come on, just come in. Please. Oh, he's gonna one shot me. Oh, he's gonna come in closer. Oh my god, he's gonna finish me before I can finish him. Deliver the final freaking blow, dude, if I can. Holy hell. <laughs> there we go. Alright, that's one down. Alright, and you had to defeat both of them to get the armor, so let's go and drag the second one away. And he's absolutely just gonna ruin my day. Fantastic. All right, so we have three heals left, and well, let's just say it's not our day, boys. It's not. Our day. All right. We're gonna play this nice and slow. Our last two heals gone like that. We're gonna have to play very careful because this man is an absolute animal. We're not gonna get close to him at all because he just keeps hitting us. Yeah, we got it. We got this, we got this. Play nice and slow. And he still hits me like that. Alright, we are down to our last straw boys. It's now or never. So low too. So low. Come on, fight me. I said fight. Oh my god, he's gonna one shot me like a second. So. There we go. Dead. And once he dies, there's the freaking armor. Let's freaking go. Oh my god. That was, that was, wow. That took too much energy. Anyways, that's pretty much how you get the Knight's Cavalry Armor. Um, I thank you guys for staying so long to watch. If you guys watch that little dramatic showdown. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.